The web look is so far out that getting light has been traveling for more than 13 billion years. However, the universe has been expanding, and in this manner, the light has been stretching out for the most far-off universes. We're thinking back in time, almost to the Big Bang. The monstrosity of the universe could appear huge, but each and every piece of it started from what we refer to as the singularity. This is how we could decipher the Big Bang theory. However, the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, has uncovered critical secrets about the birth and development of the universe, leaving us stunned. Renowned physicist Brian Cox has declared that the essential discoveries made by the JWST may, all things considered, reshape how we understand the universe in general. Join us as we dive into these new glorious revelations that promise to change our comprehension. The James Webb Space Telescope, named after the renowned NASA Administrator James E. Webb, stands as a miracle in modern cosmic exploration. This telescope represents an immense technological leap forward from its precursor, the Hubble Space Telescope. Coming to fruition due to a collaborative effort between NASA, the European Space Agency, and the Canadian Space Agency, the JWST outperforms the capabilities of its predecessor. It uses cutting-edge technology and a design optimized for observing the universe in astonishing detail. Not like the Hubble, the JWST delivers clear and sharp images of distant celestial bodies, primarily working in the infrared spectrum. This intriguing feature allows it to penetrate galactic dust and capture celestial objects that were previously hidden from view. With its massive 6.5-meter primary mirror made from 18 hexagonal segments, the JWST is much smaller than Hubble's reflector size. Positioned about 1.5 million kilometers away from Earth at the second Lagrange point, L2, it orbits the Sun in harmony with Earth, ensuring a steady and continuous view of the universe. While exploring the farthest corners of the universe, it also involves a kind of time travel. The JWST utilizes infrared instruments to capture glorious objects and events stretching back billions of years. The light emitted by these objects, due to the expanding universe, undergoes redshift, shifting from the visible range to the infrared spectrum or longer. Fortunately, the JWST can detect infrared light emitted by distant bodies, enabling scientists to study the formation of stars, explore galactic evolution, and analyze exoplanet climates. Its latest groundbreaking discovery involves identifying a vast number of galaxies at the edge of the observable universe. This finding challenges the validity of the current theory of cosmic evolution, prompting a reassessment of our key cosmological assumptions to better understand how we got here. To comprehend how we arrived at this point, we must take a short journey through the history of space exploration. Early civilizations like the Greeks and Chinese laid the groundwork for understanding planetary development by observing celestial bodies. Newton's laws in the 17th century provided a theoretical framework for space travel. In the 20th century, Edwin Hubble, an influential astronomer, made groundbreaking discoveries in cosmology and observational astronomy. His observations revealed that distant nebulae were isolated galaxies, far beyond the Milky Way, changing our understanding of the universe's size and expansion. Hubble's law, formulated by him, showed that galaxies farther away were moving at higher speeds, providing evidence for the expansion of the universe. The post-World War II history of space exploration marked the beginning of the space race, with the Soviet Union launching Sputnik in 1957 as the first artificial satellite. Yuri Gagarin's orbital flight in 1961 and the Apollo 11 moon landing in 1969 were pivotal milestones. Fast forward to 1990, when the Hubble Space Telescope was launched, providing exceptional clarity and stunning insights into the universe. The journey from ancient observations to the technological marvels of the James Webb Space Telescope highlights the continuous evolution of our understanding of the universe. Hubble revealed the vastness of space and altered fundamental concepts in astronomy. Take the Hubble Space Telescope, HSD, as an example. It captured the famous pillars of creation image in the Eagle Nebula, revealing a stellar nursery formed by massive clouds of gas and dust. Another major achievement was the Hubble Deep Field, which captured a multitude of galaxies in an apparently empty patch of space. The HSD also delved into exoplanet climates, pinpointing elements like water and organic molecules in distant worlds, suggesting the possibility of habitable zones beyond our solar system.
By tracking the evolution of the nearby supernova SN1987A, it shed light on the life cycle of massive stars. These accomplishments solidified the Hubble Space Telescope's legacy as a cornerstone of modern cosmology, astonishing the world with its extraordinary cosmic discoveries. Its successor, the James Webb Space Telescope, was launched to build upon the technological advances and lessons learned from the Hubble mission. The JWST seeks to further our understanding of the universe's origins, a model currently explained by the prevailing theory of the Big Bang, which occurred approximately 13.8 billion years ago. The universe began as an extremely hot and dense singularity, rapidly expanding and leading to matter, energy, and fundamental forces. As the universe expanded, it cooled, leading to the formation of atoms, stars, galaxies, in the complex structures we observe today. The Big Bang Theory also explains background radiation, light element abundances, the universe. Despite its wide acceptance, the Big Bang Theory faced skepticism and challenges in its early days. Alternative models, such as the steady state theory, proposed a universe without a definitive beginning and concerns about evidence supporting the initial singularity expansion, and observed inconsistencies emerge. An infinity of Most worlds, of these objections all operating were different frequencies. Time, and a significant piece of evidence came with the detection of cosmic microwave background radiation in 1965, confirming Big Bang predictions. Space missions like COBE and WMAB, along with technological advancements, further supported the theory, with precise measurements of cosmic microwave background radiation matching theoretical expectations. Enter the James Webb Space Telescope. Equipped with advanced infrared instruments capable of peering through vast dust clouds, the JWST, primarily operating in the infrared range, captures the oldest light in the universe and observes objects formed shortly after the Big Bang. Its infrared capabilities allow it to focus on star-forming regions, stellar nurseries, and the evolution of stars hidden from optical telescopes. Infrared light, with its longer wavelengths compared to visible light, can penetrate interstellar dust overcoming a limitation of the Hubble Space Telescope. The JWST can detect cooler objects emitting primarily in infrared, making it ideal for studying phenomena such as exoplanets, brown dwarfs, and distant galaxies. As celestial objects move away from us, their emitted light waves stretch, causing a shift to longer wavelengths, or redshift. The JWST's infrared capabilities can detect these redshifted signals, capturing light from the early universe and offering insights into its formation and evolution. Energetic events like black hole mergers or new star births primarily emit in the infrared range, further enhancing the JWST's investigative power. The telescope can explore phenomena that would otherwise be hidden or invisible. The JWST complements optical telescopes like Hubble by offering enhanced sensitivity and the ability to detect infrared radiation. This capability allows it to peer deeper into space and probe further into galactic history, uncovering hidden cosmic wonders and providing a more comprehensive view of the universe's development. The JWST serves as our window into the early stages of cosmic evolution. Recently, it uncovered something so astonishing that it may prompt a reevaluation of the entire cosmological model of the universe. We have discovered enormous galaxies at the very edge of the observable universe. These ancient galaxies existed only a few hundred million years after the Big Bang during the cosmic dawn. The puzzling part is that we are uncertain how such massive structures formed so early in the universe's history. This discovery could lead us to reconsider our understanding of cosmic evolution. Also, the advancement of cosmic systems in the early universe concentrating on early cosmic systems is essential for unwinding the secrets of astronomical beginnings. The JWST can acquire experiences into how worlds, stars, and planetary frameworks emerged and developed over billions of years. These perceptions additionally add to more extensive inquiries about the major idea of the universe, including its structure and the forces governing its advancement. While the Hubble Space Telescope was notable for its time, it had limitations in noticing the early universe. Its fundamental restriction was its powerlessness to penetrate successfully through inestimable residue and identify the infrared light produced by old cosmic systems. More seasoned telescopes depended on noticeable and bright light perceptions, 
making it challenging to investigate the early universe, where these frequencies are consumed or contorted by interstellar residue and gas. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, represents a huge jump forward in noticing worlds from the universe's beginning phases. Not at all like its ancestors, the JWST can notice heavenly items that shaped within a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. Utilizing its infrared responsiveness and advanced imaging capacities, the JWST has uncovered a wealth of old worlds, offering noteworthy lucidity and detail in figuring out the universe's transformative history. Primer outcomes from JWST perceptions have blended waves in established cosmological models. The detailed information challenges several parts of prevailing hypotheses, inciting cosmologists to rethink essential principles governing how we grasp grandiose advancement and structure. Errors between noticed information and hypothetical expectations have started serious discussions within the academic community. JWST perceptions have uncovered a larger number of cosmic systems in the early universe than expected by existing models, recommending a more intricate and rapid development process. Some noticed early worlds appear more evolved than anticipated, challenging traditional models that predicted slower advancement. The discovery of an unbelievable mass of worlds challenges the accepted dispersion and arrangement of huge structures, uncovering a more perplexing and denser astronomical web than previously thought. These perceptions raise interesting inquiries and roads for further investigation. The presence of huge designs challenges early models of grandiose design arrangement, provoking analysts to refine models for a better explanation. Understanding how such tremendous designs accumulated quickly after the Big Bang presents a puzzle that requires an explanation that doesn't violate key principles of cosmology. Significant differences in the states of the early universe, compared with forecasts based on existing models, have also been uncovered. These distinctions could suggest previously obscure physical processes, unforeseen circumstances, or unidentified grandiose phenomena. In simple terms, these varieties have prompted researchers to reevaluate and improve our models of the universe. Right now, all we can do is say that further investigation is needed to consolidate these amazing perceptions into a more extensive comprehension of the universe's beginning. Perceptions frequently provide invigorating glimpses into the universe, but in depth examinations sometimes reveal contrasts. For instance, early perceptions might show specific properties or arrangements within far off systems that, upon closer inspection, reveal variations in their peace structure or transformative pathways. In the end, tremendous peculiarities are incredibly intricate and require cautious examination for us to precisely figure out their true essence. Spectroscopy, a technique that unwinds the properties and history of heavenly objects, is a model. It involves breaking down the light discharged or absorbed by galactic items. By examining the properties of the light, Spectroscopy gives detailed data about the compound organization, temperature, density, and development of divine bodies. This investigation helps us grasp the beginnings, development, and contributions of divine bodies to the infinite embroidered artwork. The JWSD has revealed various cases where starting perceptions contrasted from later examinations. For example, starting perceptions of far-off galaxies proposed a straightforward design fundamentally dominated by lighter components like hydrogen and helium, in accordance with theoretical assumptions. However, spectroscopic examination utilizing the JWST showed entrancing varieties in chemical markers, identifying heavier components or mixtures previously undetected or misjudged in the early universe. This challenges traditional ideas about the early universe's chemical composition and the elements responsible for their development and scattering across vast distances. Similarly, starting presumptions about cosmic systems in the early universe were based on fundamental perceptions suggesting a generally uniform pattern of advancement and organization. However, more detailed examinations by the JWST uncovered a considerably more diverse and complex exhibit of chemical organizations inside these systems. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, continues to reclassify our comprehension of the universe by shedding light on previously hidden corners of the universe. One of its most interesting capabilities is its capacity to study exoplanets in exceptional detail. By analyzing the atmospheres of planets orbiting far-off stars, 
The JWSD can identify crucial chemical markers such as the presence of water vapor, carbon dioxide, methane, and other organic compounds. These discoveries provide valuable insights into the potential habitability of exoplanets and the conditions that could support life beyond Earth. As well as exploring far-off galaxies, the JWST is transforming how we understand star development. It can observe the birth of stars in regions where young stars are surrounded by thick clouds of gas and dust, which optical telescopes cannot penetrate. With its ability to detect infrared light, the JWST captures the faintest flickers of these new stars as they emerge from the darkness, offering a clearer picture of the processes that lead to star and planetary system formation. By studying these regions, cosmologists are gaining a deeper understanding of how stars like our sun form and evolve over time. Another significant aspect of JWST research is its ability to peer into the hearts of galaxies. Supermassive black holes are believed to reside at the centers of most large galaxies. JWST's advanced instruments allow researchers to observe the behavior of matter around these black holes, providing new insights into their development, their impact on cosmic evolution, and the powerful jets of energy they produce. These discoveries are helping cosmologists piece together the story of how galaxies and their central black holes evolve together, affecting each other's growth. Furthermore, the JWST's discoveries are not just answering long-standing questions, but also raising new ones as it probes deeper into the history of the universe. It is revealing phenomena that challenge existing hypotheses and models. These challenges drive established researchers to refine current cosmological models and open up new paths for research that were previously unfathomable. The revelations of the JWST are not only pushing the boundaries of what we know, but they are also helping to reshape the fundamental principles of how we view the universe itself.